This video is going to show how to perform a schematic design rule check in ORCAD X Capture. Design rule checks are important at the schematic stage to accurately communicate design intent and avoid costly respins. Open the provided design in ORCAD Capture. Select CaptureTutorial.dsn in the project hierarchy. First, let's configure the design rule options. Select PCB Design Rules Check from the menu. Online DRC will check the configured rules in real time as you design. In the Options tab, under Batch DRC, select Run on Design from the DRC Action drop-down menu. This will run the design rule check on the entire design when prompted. Select Instances from the Properties drop-down. Select Create DRC Markers from the Warning drop-down. This will allow for easy identification of both warnings and errors directly in the schematic canvas. Select Do Not Preserve from the Wave drop-down. This will ignore any previously waived DRC errors and report all design rule violations again. Select DRC Window from the Show DRC Outputs drop-down. This will list the DRC violations in the DRCs tab at the bottom of the window and automatically open the tab. Select the ellipsis for Report to open the file browser. Browse for a location to save the report. Enter a name for the file and click Open. The report will be saved as a plain text file in this location. The DRC window has additional option panels for further customization. Select the Rules Setup tab on the left side of the window. Here you can configure which electrical, physical, and simulation rules are included in the design rule check. Rules with the online option are checked in real time, while rules with the batch option are checked when the DRC check is run. Select the Report Setup tab. Here you can choose which aspects of the check to report. Select the ERC Matrix tab. Here you can configure which violations are flagged as warnings and which are flagged as errors. Select the Exception Setup tab. Here you can configure exceptions. Select the Options tab to return to the first options panel. Let's run the design rule check. Select Run to start the process. A prompt will appear that the check will clear the undo redo cache. Click Yes to accept. When the check is complete, another prompt will appear that one or more errors or warnings were encountered. Click No to keep the session log closed. When the check finishes, all areas of concern are marked with a green marker. Hold Ctrl and scroll up to zoom into the board. Double-click the first error on the list to be brought to the location of the marker. This warning is for a potential short between two nets, Ground and Ground 1, on ICU-1. Since these are the same net, a short is expected, and this warning can be ignored. DRC markers like this can be waived. Left-click to select the DRC marker. Right-click the marker and select Wave DRC. Click anywhere on the board to deselect the marker. The marker disappears, but the error is still listed. To refresh the error list, select PCB Design Rules Check from the menu. Select Preserve from the Wave DRC drop-down. This will preserve Wave DRCs and update the list. Select Run to rerun the DRC check. Click Yes to accept any prompts that appear, and click No to not open the session log. Scroll to the right side of the DRC table. Waved now has a value of Yes for the first row, indicating that the DRC was waived. Repeat these procedures as needed to correct or waive any errors in your design. To clear the DRC markers, select PCB Design Rules Check from the menu. Select Delete DRC Markers from the DRC Action menu. Select Run and select Yes for any prompts that appear. Hold Control and scroll down to zoom out and view the full design. The DRC markers have been removed. Quickly find and correct design errors with the Schematic Design Rule Check and ORCAD X Capture. For more tutorials, visit us at resources.ema-eda.com, and don't forget to like and subscribe to our YouTube channel.